coming up right after this local forecast. This local forecast has been brought to you by Zim's Crack Cream, your skin's new best friend. great today. Uh, it's Sunday, and uh, that makes it the 23rd of January. We looked out the window yesterday and saw the snow coming down. I thought we'd share it with you, too. Uh, these are some shots from Oshawa yesterday. Oshawa, Ontario, east of Toronto. Picked up about four centimeters of snow. Big puff of snowflakes coming down. More snow is in our forecast, and our update on active weather starts right now. <laughs> Well, the cleanup uh, was on yesterday in Moncton, New Brunswick. Look at the snowbanks. You know, Moncton, um, cities in Canada, over 100,000. Moncton is the snowiest. Um, generally close to four meters of snow per winter, close to. Uh, so the cleanup was on from your latest storm. Be careful getting around. Now there's more snow on the way. It develops this afternoon and is with you overnight and through the day tomorrow in Newfoundland. It'll be messiest in St. John's where you get five to ten centimeters of snow, but then it goes over to rain for a bit, and then it goes back to snow, and of course the winds will kick in out of the west with this, and uh, it will certainly get sloppy. Also, wind chills are a factor. It'll feel like the minus 20s, even when your thermometer gets up around minus 10 or minus 12, and so Halifax feeling like 17 below zero is a little bit harsh for a uh, Haligonian, that's for sure. Uh, this cold air also extends west through Quebec. There are advisories in place. It's cold in Ontario when it gets cold in the Great Lakes. Well, Canadians, we like to do different things in the winter, um, like race our cars um, on the ice. So they were doing some ice racing in Minden, Ontario yesterday. It's uh, yeah, the start of the ice racing season, so that's a lot of fun, but <laughs> we have to bundle up for that. Um, so the problem this weekend is this big area of high pressure from the Arctic is sagging to the south. You know, I was looking at temperatures on the west side of Hudson Bay, minus 40s on the east side of Hudson Bay. Uh, minus 20s, but the high, but I mean this high pressure drops in and does it ever make it cold? So if the wind chill, all oh, I'll feel like 32 degrees below zero. That's cold on the skateway there. It'll feel like minus 24 in Toronto. In northern Ontario, it'll feel closer to minus 40 degrees with the wind chills. Uh, so that's, I mean, that is really cold. You know, there's all these cold weather alerts in place across the country. If you get homeless people in off the streets, there's a problem yesterday. Uh, and the uh, Toronto police were out on their horses searching for a Alzheimer patient who, you know, got disoriented and, and disappeared. Anyway, they found him safely. He was inside a drugstore. But it was pretty nice to see these great beasts out on the streets as well, wasn't it? Our weather watch is on in the west today, too. Mm -hmm. 